I don't know how many do it yourselves. Do it yourself. I hope I'm saying it right. Do it yourself. Um, you like to work on your vehicle from time to time because you want to know how it works. I'm not an actual mechanic, but I do work on cars from time to time. And when I say work on cars, my cars, nobody else's, my cars. So the problem that I was having this, I think it's T-I-M-P, this box right here. I heard on YouTube, everybody complaining how much it cost. Uh, I went to AutoZone and they wanted 400 and something dollars. Probably would have came out to 450 or whatever with tax and all that. But I went to a junkyard and I bought one for $80. It worked, had it since last year, so it gave me about six months and then it didn't work anymore. Meaning my right or facing it, my left, ah, my right. And my left passenger headlights not working right now as you can see they're off so what I'm gonna do just turn the lights on so you can see and look I got them both working this is still messed up because it's a circuit board in here it's about the length of the box and one that goes underneath it the length of the box but bottom line is this is crap the way they designed it so get down to the nitty-gritty on how I did that been watching a lot of people and I've been thinking about doing it but someone beat me to it you can see where I splice a red wire to the white and blue wire all right and I ran it underneath through all this stuff so you can see right here there goes a the red wire you know I ran it back there it's right here I'm gonna have to make sure it doesn't get near the belt as you can see but there it is right there and the first time I thought I, it was this part right here so I replaced that but turned out it wasn't that so I got a brand new part in there for no reason and yes, I know it looks like crap, but like I said, I'm just trying to get it working so I can drive back and forth to work. Other than that, I ain't got to worry about it. I can see. Just like everybody else. So thank you, YouTube. You do show a lot of good stuff on there, as well as the people talking about the stuff. Um, I wish they'd be a little bit more in detail because when they're holding the camera, they're pointing down like this with the camera. And sometimes it might be too dark for you to see. That's why I put the light on. You can see the red connected to the blue wire. And that's what powers it. So, bottom line. Thanks again, everybody on YouTube that helped me out. Talk to you later. Do it yourself type of guy. That's what I am. <laughs> My engine's dirty, but that's okay. It still runs. Later.